Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to Subnautica. If you are newer to the channel and have not played Subnautica, well, or don't haven't seen me play Subnautica, well, welcome to it. It's a really fun underwater survival game. It's, it's probably one of the better uh, survival games on Early Access there are, pr produced by a developer who is very caring about the product itself. Every so often, I like to re return to this game to do a 10 to 15 episode mini-series as it were, to see all the new things. And it's actually been a very, very long time since I've actually played Subnautica, to the point where there's been so many updates that the game is going to be very fresh and very new for me, and I'm excited to dive back into it. That's what is why I decided uh, to talk, uh, to go back and play it for a little bit and see what you guys thought about it. Uh, so I'm excited to play in, we're going to jump into a new game, and we're just going to get right down to it. New game, we'll be playing on... Survival? Wait, so this okay, this is a little different than the last time I played. Hardcore. Survival mode with only one life, no O2 alerts. Like survival but without hunger and thirst, and then survival, which is your typical normal hunger, thirst, health, all that stuff. And then creative is build anything you want. We're gonna be going into your typical survival. I will load back in once it is all loaded up. Well, that sucks. <laughs> that introduction is brand new for me. I don't know how long it's been in the game, but that's kind of awesome. Also, I'm just, uh, all right. Whoop, oh, shit, shit's on fire. Just punch it, man. My, oh, okay, all right. Uh, pick up the fire extinguisher. This is new, this is new. Uh, what, am I, I click, I'm clicking. Oh, right click. You right click to use it. That's not how it works. It should work. It should be left click. That's okay. All right. Actually, that's awesome. Because every time you loaded this game up before, um, you didn't. I mean, this thing was all beaten up and destroyed, but you never knew why your escape pod was destroyed. Survivor. Great job not dying. Thanks. To assist you in further survival in emergency situations, you have been issued this personal data assistant. The interface visible now will organize your inventory, display currently available construction blueprints, Ooh. and holds other valuable information. Please take a moment to familiarize yourself with it. This is all very new. All right. I like it. Uh, the fire extinguisher is probably not incredibly useful at this point, but that's okay. So this is the fabricator where we can craft things. All right, so that's like a crafting table. That's always been there. Uh, yes, the container. Oh, we actually get some stuff. Flare. Flare. Filtered water and a couple nutrient blocks. Okay, so you're not completely fucked when it comes to needing food right away. Attention. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. All right. That's awesome. All right. Can we head up then? We're heading out. Oh, there's the Aurora. There it is. That's a familiar sight for anybody who's played this game before and completely surrounded by nothing but the vast of deep blue. All right. Well, we best get working then, shall we? Uh, into the water we go. Might as well just dive in. I think the water physics and water in general has been tweaked since last I played, so I'm interested to see how what it looks. But in we go. Still got a weird walking animation when you dive into the water. Um, let's actually take a look. Mouse sensitivity. All right, there's no graphical options. That's interesting. Ooh, that was a weird. Oh, there's one of those like sea manatee things. All right. Well, welcome to Subnautica. Let's get back to it, shall we? We need to start immediately, gr like grabbing things. We got titanium chunk. So we're looking for basic food and all kinds of good stuff. Um, our, our oxygen is not going to last terribly long. That's not a bad thing. Because we can upgrade that as time goes on. Grabbing some quartz. Can I grab that? Alright, we gotta we're going to run up. One of my favorite things about this game is how well they did the underwater sounds. 
they did such a good job with it. Uh, how the how the like the ocean creatures sound and stuff. I hope that they've added some more scarier creatures that can like come out of the out of the darkness. Come here, come here, you asshole. Apparently, it's just too much for me. It's thing. Come here. There we go. Got a fish. Uh, that'll be food for later. Grabbing a few fish isn't a bad idea. I guess the fish who don't who can't be eaten aren't, aren't afraid of me. Come here, you piece of shit. Come here. That's mine. There we go. Couple peepers. Not a bad thing. Emergency. Uh, only 10, ten seconds, seconds of oxygen. oxygen. Man, I forgot how fast your oxygen can plummet when you don't have any of the upgrades at all. So, all right, I basically need to be grabbing as much stuff as I can um, and cracking open like these little rocks right here in hopes of getting uh, enough stuff to make like a knife. Uh, with a knife, we can start breaking and hurting enemies and all kinds of good stuff. So, and these, this. Okay, that's a new noise. Broadcasting of automated short range distress signal failed. Life pod communications relay something or other. Didn't catch the last minute there. Um, but we need to get ourselves a knife. Uh, kind of quickly. All these caves and we can't do shit with it because our oxygen is just balls awful. We also need to find salt. Because salt will allow us to start cooking these fish. Is it already getting dark? Are you serious right now, game? It is already getting dark. That is unfortunate. Yeah, we can't get very deep at all. We're basically just kind of left with uh, our immediate surroundings as what we can work with. Grab some quartz while I can. What is this? Is this salt? No, it's more quartz. All right. Kind of getting a, uh, hey, how's it going? You still friendly? You still friendly? Emergency. Oh, okay. Ten nope, they're not friendly. Apparently, they drop like poison poops. Well, if the drive core is breached. Probability of death increases to 65%. Pick up creature egg. Okay. So, if I die by radiation, man, either I'm going to go out like a champ and I'm going to, well, rather go out like a chump and just die of radiation poisoning, or I'm going to get sweet fucking superpowers out of the radiation. It's a gamble I'm willing to make, I think. Let's keep grabbing this stuff. Basically, we're just going to spend the, the beginnings here, just kind of doing what we got to do by grabbing all the necessary things if we can so far so good so these guys attack now or at least they drop like poison poops that's what it looked like that's new they didn't used to do that last time I played the game not a big deal they, at least they're relatively slow and they're not like swimming at me and trying to murder my ass which is appreciated all right let's see if we can craft anything with what we've grabbed so we can actually just pop in Oh, there's actually an animation now for climbing in. All right, I'm down with that. Sustenance. Water. So we need bleach to make water. Cooked food, we can cook some cooked peepers. Do we need anything other than a peeper for that? Protein-rich eyeballs, small bones, add texture. My, my favorite. Oh, we can cure it for the peeper and a salt deposit. Sure. We might as well do that. I don't know what the difference is, but that's interesting that we can do both. Electronics, we can't make anything. Basic materials, glass. And we can break down the metal salvage for titanium. I'm more curious in equipment, however. Maybe tools? Survival knife. We need silicone rubber. Whoa, 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 that's not what I mean to, I made, so I wanted to know what that was. Waterproof locker. That is not what I wanted to make at all, actually. Um, let's take our metals and make titanium, I guess. So we have a waterproof locker now, guys. That was a mistake, however. Can we make silicon rubber from this? So we need creep vine seed clusters times two so that's what we need creep vine seed clusters is what we are looking for right now why don't we then 
Pop at least. Look at how fucking huge that is. Uh. We'll chow on this and fill up on food. Head back under. Oh, Jesus Christ. This actually is beautiful. Holy crap. It is so pretty. Alright. Well, we need to find creep vines, which are basically giant. These things. They look like kelp forests. Yeah, alright. Whatever you say. So we need a few seeds if we're gonna make a knife. And then with a knife, we can actually do some stuff. So, I'm curious. Does nighttime matter in this game? It used to not really matter outside of uh, vision. Local radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core. A quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5%. Advise observing a one kilometer safety range. Is it gonna blow up now? We gotta get up there. We're gonna need air. I don't know if we're far enough away or or what. I need creep vine seeds. Doesn't look like I can get any. All right, so that thing down there is actually very aggressive. That is a pain in the ass to deal with. So I'm gonna try try to avoid him. He likes to grab metal from what I remember and like run off with it. The problem with these creep vine forests is that they're they go very very deep. Yeah, see he's a I think he ate a fish. I saw some blood spurt there. Let's get back above ground. Emergency. 10 seconds of oxygen remaining. Hope you guys don't have desolophobia. I believe it's what it's called. Fear of uh deep waters. Because that's what this game is all about. Sticking your whole body in deep, wet areas where it should not be. It's my favorite thing. Oh, shit. Give me more. Oh, shit! Fuck off, man. So I got ten seeds, I think? God, that, that made me jump a little bit. I'll head back over here. It's, it's decently far. Did we get... Do we get 10 or no? Old cooked paper. We'll eat that right now. I picked up titanium doing that? Uh, we'll pop another filtered water. We're getting like stuff and I don't know where from. We're picking up titanium somewhere. I'm gonna drop it for now. Emergency. Size oh shit. Suggest a quantum detonation has occurred oh shit. Drive core. The central Here we go. Reactor will reach a super critical state. A T minus. Ten. Nine. Eight. Oh boy, seven, the Aurora's gonna go. Six. Five. Four. Oh. Three. Two. Ooh, damn. Oh, it looks so good when it goes down, though. Fuck. Well. There goes our roar. That is new, by the way. That is very new. We got hit with radiation. I actually did a little damage. Watching that thing orbit. Oh, look at this. It's like flying animals and stuff. That is brand new. I love it. This game has drastically changed. Uh, I thought we had a creep find seed cluster. We do not. Gonna make some glass though. All right, we need to go back. I dumped the. I dumped the locker. It may suck that I dumped it, but I kind of needed to right now. I don't really regret it. That explosion was fucking badass, though. Cool guys don't look at explosions, therefore, I am not a cool guy. But I'm okay with that, because the explosion looked cool enough to replace my lack of coolosity? Coolness? 
Coolio. Coolio. All right, let's go. Let's grab seed clusters again. Hopefully we don't get bitten by the asshole fucking fish. Okay. There we go. What is that noise? What the fuck? Do you hear that rumbling? Inventory full again. Oh, they're big. Okay. Oh, it's that. It's like seismic volcanic activity. Very cool. Emergency. Ten seconds. We're fine. We're fine. Game. Relax. Breathe. All right. So we have enough to make some silicone. So that's what we're gonna do. And then with that, we should be able to get ourselves our knife, which is a nice first thing to do. And then we have a, a way of at least defending ourselves and killing some some easier food, maybe, or some better food, rather. Bigger fish and all that good stuff. So, lubricant. I don't need any. I don't need no lubricant. How do I make bleach? Salt deposit, common coral sample. So, yeah, we definitely need... There we go. A knife for that alone. Okay, so we'll go down here. Equipment. Knife. So now, the knife has been an essential tool of the human race for actually two and a half million years. It is recommended that you look after this one. Nice. Beautiful. Stop swinging it around like a fool. So what we need now is like common coral. We right click. So now we got this. A whole new world. A dazzling place I never knew. Da -da -da, way up here. It's crystal clear. Ba -na 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 -na. Okay. I don't know why it says inventory secured. But I don't know what that means. So with that. Common coral sample. Well, how do I get common coral samples? Synthetic fibers, electronics. Common coral samples. The hell is a common coral sample? I need to really start concerning myself about uh, water and stuff now, otherwise I'm gonna get fucked. Is this it? Okay, yep, it's this. So the green stuff is common coral samples. So green stuff plus salt equal common coral samples. We can do that. We can make that work. This will give us our, our water. Our inventory is apparently full. Damn. That is a... Emergency. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. We're fine. <laughs> We're totally fine. Alright, let's grab over here. Boom, boom. Bleach. How many bleaches can we make? Just that one. No! Ah! I'm so sick of clicking on that accidentally. I'll learn. I'll learn the hard way. It's my own fault, but still. Okay. I picked up disinfected water. We need... Is there anywhere I can... I can store stuff in here, right? Yeah. So, I can just be like... Store everything. Store that. Table coral. I wish it stacked. I don't know why it, they, the game does not want it to stack, but it does not. All right, that's fine. I think going out and now we're looking for basically salt and uh, and common coral samples. That's kind of like the crux of what we need right now. We can make that work. Very basics of surviving, but it's working. Can you please? Why are you not? Why are you not breaking? My knife is now no longer effective on that for some reason. All right, no problem. Maybe it's just the only invincible coral plate in the goddamn game. I don't know why. Emergency. Yeah. Ten gimme, 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 gimme. Up we go. Take a breath. So salt. Salt can come from just laying around, and I. I think it can come from those little rocks on the side, like these. I'm pretty sure. 
Okay. That's titanium. Man, there's a lot of these, like, poison butt sea manatees. Gigantic poison ass sacks. Literally. Don't you... Don't give me that weird music. I feel like it's combat music. It's not. It feels like it. Alright, I'm not seeing shit. But that's okay. I think this is a good place to stop the intro episode. It's good to be back to Subnautica. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm very excited to see what you guys think in the comment section below. Let me know if you guys want to see some more Subnautica. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.